Hi there, it's Roy Breton here. Hope you're doing well. Today on my thumbnail, the title is Beware YouTube Altered Content. And what it is, um, just the last week or so, not for not very long, um, here I've got a picture of a, um, or a screen, I'm showing my screen of where I'm uploading a video on another channel. And there's a section here that appeared a few weeks ago that says Altered Content. And it says, do it. Do any of the following describe your content um, makes a real person appear to say or do something that they didn't say or do alters, alters footage of a real event or place generates a realistic looking scene that didn't occur occur and so i can honestly say no and what it's aimed at really is people who are using ai and changing things my, my videos are fairly basic to be fair but I'm, I'm not making things up and i try and be as truthful and real as possible so it's not going to affect me and actually although I don't agree with every all of Google's policies uh, and YouTube's policies I, I believe that this is probably quite a good one because some some people are making things um, even making people and making things things look like they happened when they didn't which is uh, pretty bad actually so here um, it, it's got um, this is the Google support page and it's got disclosing use of altered or synthetic content and it says we encourage creators in a innovative and responsible use of content editing or generation tools at the same time we recognize that viewers want to know if what they're watching or listening is real so when I'm watching something especially if it's like a how-to video or something or, or anything really I want to know that it is genuine um, so that the thing goes on to say to help viewers informed about the content they're viewing we, re we require creators to disclose content that is meaningfully altered or synthetically generated when it seems realistic which I, I as I said I think this is a good thing creators must disclose content that makes a real person appear to say or do something they didn't do altered alters footage of a real event or place generates a realistic looking scene that didn't actually a cure this could include content that is fully or partially altered or created using audio video or image image creation or editing tools and it goes on there's more I could read but basically just if you're using AI and I well, I do use AI for a few things not much but you know, certainly not for creating content then be warned and uh, take care and I think it's for everyone's good to be fair now here I've got another tab open um, well, let's go let's go back to here if I scroll further up here um, there's a there's a, um, a section yes it's made for kids no it's not made for kids I just do that to be on the safe side so um, not that any of my videos are offensive but I've just done that uh, for the sake of it really um, but in this if we come on to the settings here so I, I've gone to settings in fact let's close that and let's go to settings um, channel and then I'm going to advanced settings and I could change it here for the, for the um, I could either review it for every setting or, or as you saw I've got it set that this channel is not made for kids and I'm guessing that this um, this may they may have a setting for the altered content eventually there's not yet but um, I'm hoping there might be soon it's just one less box to tick if you know what I mean um, when that happens I, I will let you know and create another video but just take care if you're using AI, AI to make content um, otherwise you could be caught out with your YouTube channel if you've got any questions I'm here to help thank you very much for watching